Hello guys! Today I'm finally going to start the installation of my Chinese diesel heater. My Vanagon has been cold for over two years, so now it's time. So let's start! Well, a big hole in my car. Look at this guys, a big hole in my car. <laughs> I don't know if I like it or not, but no, there is no way back. Then, this one, hopefully. Yes, that should be good. Okay, I have now installed this uh, bracket, four screws in one in each corner. I have draw a half circle here, so I know approximately where the hole is going. Which is come out here and then again out here and in here. So let's start drilling. This hole is for the fueling pump wire, so don't forget that one. Will be like this. Excellent. And here we go. One hole. Let's see if it fits. Yes! It's working! Fantastic. Amazing! I think that looks uh, very nice. And here we go, looking good. Okay, that it's tight and nice. And uh, there we have it. Need a little fine tuning, but um, I don't think it should be far off. Yes, then the fuel pump which is the most exciting one. I have to cut the fuel line from the diesel tank and it is at least 20 liters in there now, now so yeah. It's um, a lot easier to pull this uh, fuel pump wiring through the frame in the car if you remove the plug. And the plug has two locks, one on each side here, which needs to press. 
buy some tiny tools. And here we go. Both pins out. I'm not sure about if there is any polarity since both wires are white, but I have put a small black mark here and a small black mark over here. Yes, then I can put it through the frame. Okay, here we have the installation. Let's see if I can. This is the fuel line. Cut in half. Filter. Fuel pump. And fuel line over the frame well, let's see going all the way fuel line coming to the frame together with the power to the fuel pump yes and here we have the exhaust. Which again goes out on the side. Oh my gosh! Whoa. I have not started the priming. Still some bubbles. air bubbles coming still but it's working okay let's take a closer look at the installation it is over here remote controller Yes, everything works excellent except for the height, minus 108 meters below sea level. Fantastic. Okay, and the heater itself is put down here. It's a nice little 2 kilowatt. Wiring here. And the heated output is over here. And that goes through the rear bench. 
out to the side. Yes! Amazing, huh? Fantastic. working guys and I must say it's amazing a fantastic hot air is now coming out of the vent of course it's impossible for you to see or feel it but it's very hot I would say it must be close to 50 degrees amazing And here we have it, 119 degrees case temperature. Fantastic! It's working excellent. <laughs> you just have to smile. This is amazing. For 120 euros or dollars or British pounds, it's amazing for a little money. <laughs> Absolutely fantastic. Okay, back home from the installation. I'm testing the red remote. My car is standing just outside here. It's about five, six meters away. And when we are pressing, okay. Please wait. You see, it's not the best. Ah, here we go. And I hold it close to the window, then I can maybe take it away. And let's see. Then we can flip through the menus, hopefully. Okay, stamping, yes. Voltage. It's a little slow, but uh, I would say around five, six, maybe seven meters inside the house. That's the limit at least when I'm testing this, because if I move it further away, I will not get any good result. Nothing. No, it does not like it, but if I put it closer to the window again, there we go, and everything is working, except from the focus. Oh, works here as well, fantastic. But the heater is an excellent product, at least First start works excellent. I put it on 23 degrees and it was somewhere inside the car. The outside temperature here in Norway right now was uh, 6 degrees. You can see the snow is still in my backyard. Eye. And it went on for about 10 15 minutes and the car was already warm. I say it's amazing. I say uh, 2 kilowatts seems to be the right uh, size for the, the Wanagon. If you have any bigger, I think it will be way too hot. So, that's my experience so far. Thanks for watching guys. Hope to see you again. Bye bye.